Well, you join me at a very good time, Francois, because the athletes have uh, just come through the presidential gates, in fact. With uh, Equestrian, there were two gold medals. Boxing, two golds as well. Judo, two golds. Boxing, six medals in total. Judo, five medals in total. Japan were actually the only side to have fared better in the judo with 12 medals. Nobody's ever going to catch the Japanese, but France were the second best nation in that event. All are still at the moment. El Nene, who started well. That's Xhaka. Lovely play this from the Gunners. In towards Lacazette. Clearance only as far as Monreal. He's got men in the box, it won't be! It's 2-0 to Arsenal! And it's no more than they deserve inside the opening 10 minutes at the Emirates. Crystal Palace have just not got going. It's Alex Iwobi. Toulon do have this ability to grind out wins. They used Lee Halfpenny to full effect last season in some matches. And Bello, another break once more to Bonneval. And Toulon are in the mood. Bonneval to Van Sonclair and back to Bonneval. Was that forwards? But Bonneval has crossed the line. And Toulon are playing some sumptuous rugby. What will be the defining moment of these games for you? If you're talking about established um, stars, Francois, I think Usain Bolt, Mo Farah, example, have, have proved themselves before and they proved themselves again to become really fantastic and, well, world-class Olympians. But for me... Wade van Nierkirk, the South African, the 400 metre final. He didn't just beat the world record, which was held by 17 years by the, the American great Michael Johnson. He absolutely obliterated it, 43.03. There's Beetham, lovely offloads from the former Leicester Tiger. There's Lamara. Fernandez. Yato. He is a big burgeoning presence. And he's burst through and Clem on a level. Well, that was top class from Pekeli Yato. It's what he does best. Plenty of cracking golf to look forward to as well. But first, let's have a little recap of what happened yesterday. Just a reminder as well for all you viewers on uh, Facebook and YouTube, keep leaving your comments. Keep those questions coming in for Laura, who's going to be on the driving range a little bit later on. And Ollie, I believe there's a chance to win a car. So Manchester United's poor season appears to be getting even worse after they were beaten again, this time in Turkey, against Fenerbahce. Now Lewis Hamilton secured his 50th career victory in Formula One after a crucial win at the American Grand Prix. The Briton had to win to keep his faltering title hopes alive and the Mercedes driver led from pole as teammate Nico Rosberg had to settle for second place. Here is Papadopoulos to Ito, who's faded slightly in this second half. Here he is, though, buzzing around again to Hunt. Now with Dinkmeyer, who went close earlier. Dinkmeyer, terrific cross. There's the goal for Hamburg. On a plate for Philip Kostic, who scores against his former club. Please do not miss it. You can keep following all things Wentworth on myeuropeantour.com. But for now, from day two at Wentworth, it is goodbye. Well, that's uh, all for sports for now. Thank you very much for watching. Do stay tuned for more news, though, coming up on France Fancat.